For the first time since the Johnny Depp trial, Amber Heard speaks out on social media. Amber Heard posted an emotional message on Instagram after an unforgettable weekend at Sicily's prestigious Teormina Film Festival, where she promoted her most recent motion picture. One year after her well-publicized defamation trial with her ex-husband, Johnny Depp, the actress, 37, decided to share a sweet photo of herself looking radiant and beaming on stage. After her high-stakes legal battle with Johnny, 60, who took offense with the 2018 Washington Post article she wrote about her experiences with abuse, which his legal eagles believe to be a direct accusation against him, it's been a rough ride for the Aquaman actress. Amber succeeded in winning one of her three counterclaims, but the jury's final ruling was decisively in Johnny's favor. In December 2022, Amber left behind a moving digital footprint in which she admitted that she had made the very difficult decision to accept a settlement. She now makes it clear that she's prepared to put the past behind her and express her sincere gratitude to her devoted Instagram followers. Thank you for the wonderful response to my most recent film, In the Fire, at the Teormina Film Festival, Amber stated in her letter. The weekend will always be remembered. She added a candid photo of herself in the company of enthusiastic admirers and the ubiquitous paparazzi to the post, writing, What a reception. I'm grateful to every one of my admirers and supporters. I feel very moved. A doctor is asked to cure a troublesome young boy in Colombia who is being falsely accused of possessing a demon in the 1899 novel In the Fire. Amber was adamant that her festival presence was only to support a movie in an interview with Deadline. A big lesson I had to learn, that I'm not in control of the stories that other people make up around me, she said. I'm here to back a film, and I cannot be held liable for that. What I have been through, what I have lived through, doesn't make my career at all, she continued with a dash of disdain. And it won't stop my career, for sure. The In the Fire director, Connor Alline, expressed his joy to Deadline, saying that despite Amber going through something so awful, she was able to be true to herself. He praised her, saying, she's still the shining light. And to go through something that terrible and be able to come out the other side and be whole, well, I can't imagine it. In addition, Aline told People magazine that Amber had an incredibly bright future ahead and praised her for her acting prowess in his movie. In Aline's own words, I believe in the fire best exhibits her acting abilities. She is obviously incredibly pleased of this, and we can't wait to share it with everyone. It will be a fantastic chance for her to talk about something besides the trial and other things, and it will serve as a platform for an incredible return. The charming co-star of Amber, Luca Calvani, echoed these sentiments, saying, anyone who suffers that sort of ordeal and is able to overcome it with grace. You have to give credit for the incredible journey this woman has been through, and she can teach us all a couple of things as far as resilience and courage.